Hey everyone, welcome to question number eight. Remember to pause the video for a minute 30 seconds and then press play when you're ready. So if the diameter of the circle shown below is nine, which of the following is closest to the area of the shaded region? So that's gonna be a doozy, but we can handle it. So here's how we're gonna handle this. If I had the area of the whole thing, and then I took away the area of the circle, well then this would be a much easier problem. So one more time, if I had the area of the whole square here, whatever that is, and I subtracted that area of the circle, we'll get the area of that shaded region. So what we're gonna do then everybody, is we're gonna do exactly that. I'm gonna take the area of this, that, that big block there, and we're gonna subtract the circle, the area of the circle. All right, cool. So first and foremost, well, we got we have to compute two things. Okay, great. So the diameter is nine. We're gonna use that to our advantage because the diameter is the distance across the circle, and that's gonna be nine. And so that means that this up top is nine. And remember, the diameter is across, so also from top to bottom is also nine. So that means that this is a square, it is a square. Okay, so I wasn't just guessing, that actually is a square. And the area of a square is just side times side, which is nine times nine, or 81. Up next, let's find the area of the circle. Remember, the area of a circle is pi multiplied by r squared. And the pi can be approximated with 3.14. And r is the radius. Radius, remember, is half of the diameter. So since the diameter is 9, half the diameter is 4.5. So now, all we have to do is plug and chug. Grab that calculator, 3.14. Multiply by 4.5 squared. Make sure to use PEMDAS to make sure you compute the right way. So then we have 63.585. Then from there, we're going to go ahead and subtract that from 81, giving us, uh, I'm going to go ahead and just write that out real quick. So 63.585. And then that's going to give us 17.415. So which one's closest? Well, that'll be A, 17, 17 square units. So hopefully that helps. I really do hope it helps. So if you haven't already checked out our practice test, I really recommend you try that out. That way you can understand more precisely what it is that you need to focus on to pass on your next attempt.